Well, hello, yes, I am actually making a review of a single character and not a set. Why? Well, there is so many or many reviews of this set, so why well, so well will be another? How about we spice things up? And yes, I, I do have a set. There, you see, I have the Marai Moody from the same set the dragon is. What's important is the review of this single character, Hungarian Hortel from Lego Harry Potter from 2005. And, and, and the, the design, is, the design of it is very simple. I mean, there's, there's, this entire thing doesn't even have a move, move legs. The only thing you can move is a mouth, wings, the, the tail. And maybe that, maybe that's about it. But what's interesting is that it's uh, how how nice, nice, uh, nicely looking it, it is actually. I mean, yeah, I'm very big, big uh, size of of, of uh, pieces. I mean, that's what I expect from 2005. Like, does anyone remember Lego Dino Dino Attack, which came out for the same the same year year? Um, um, and it was also much the, much the same. I mean, you can still move the legs, uh, but it's not, you couldn't. Also, also inter interesting is also the, the part, the parts of it, like uh, wings actually has to be used to this day. There are also these ten bananas that aren't actually that really that rare. I mean, you can get that get that from, for example, minions. The piece, piece like this one, this still still exists to this day, just in different colors. And uh, but I'd say the most interesting thing is is the mouth. I mean, it really looks, in my opinion, pretty adorable for a lizard. Like it looks it looks very uh, dragon like. With some interesting parts like, like metallic gold for the eyes and teeth. But uh, my most interesting is the, the way hey, they did they did the flames. Like instead of being being just a, a clip thing, instead it actually, it actually uses uses those uh, the, the pieces the, the 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 way they design the flames back from back from the from the uh, from uh, before even the two thousands. Like, like you can see they have, have this, uh, this those those two two uh, kind of pegs my camera and the kind of pegs here here they're kind of similar similar to how the uh, accessories for example from lego friends and do and how it works is that uh, is that it attaches it that touches itself uh, right here you, you can see it attaches uh, right here for those for the holes and it, and that's how that's how uh, it basically that's how it connects basically and it's actually pretty sturdy like like it, it, like it, it, it won't, won't come out. It's as strong as a regular clip, which is very surprising. Which I mean, by the same time, by the same time, it's uh, I guess not that, not that good since it make, makes, makes it very specialized. But I could probably use, use probably some different flames, judging how how large the, the flame is. I mean, you probably could be able to close it very easily as as if this one. But I'd say I actually, I actually like it. It's not, it doesn't have, have a lot of pieces, but judging how it, how big how big it is. It will make it pretty, pretty over expensive. I mean, but to be fair, it is 2005 Lego Harry Potter, so of course, like this thing uh, right here, right here, this one, it costs 149 dollars. Holy macaroni! Like, this is this is really expensive. But at the time, I probably would spend them my much money for anyway, since I really love this thing. It looks really cool, and I'm really into dragons, so I'd say this is definitely a much, much better, much better actually to get than the new one. Which modern designs, like even we consider wrong for me to be hoarding over, over dragons, but honestly, the modern ones are, are way too hoardy, hoardy design. Like that sharp, sharp goddamn chests. Like who would want an actual chest on a dragon? Those are lizards, not goddamn furries. But to be fair, Lemon Lego is basically so realistic that they strap design characters by furry artists. Like, Jesus Christ. Ninjago's company just ruined for me. Not much really to say. The tail is also pretty possible. Like, you move it you move it more than once. Like, like you can have, have, have a 360 hinging over here, a 360 over here, and another 360 over here. And as and I can, you can see, it's, it's pretty large. Like, there's for comparison, this guy. Who, who, that's also pretty expensive for some reason. You don't know why you probably won't buy it for so much. As a comparison, it's pretty large. And also, I really like this addition here as they are like installing actual a smooth tile. It's just a 2x2 two two tile. 2x2x2, two two two, no, I mean 2x2 two two plate. Because there's a difference between a smooth, no stud plate and and one with, one with actual studs. 
how uh, in I'd say not actually pretty cool. Like like you can actually have a your own dragon rider. Which is kinda sad that Lego doesn't do anymore. For some reason that they made like once the in Lego Castle theme in like 2008 or something. And then to this thing you only feel like I don't know multiple random dragons that are just some random beast that they had to kill. Like this is a shame. I can't more more of an actual good Lego theme that you can you know ride the dragon. But yeah, I'd say as I only want to review this thing, so I'd say for a time it came out, it's very honestly very impressive. Like like without, like without this being you know without this, you could actually say it's something that you could probably you could probably expect to see nowadays. Like it has very it has very stylized uh, kind of stylized design, very very uh, modern kind of looking with all the all these uh, wings and everything like that. The only thing that kind of doesn't makes it old is uh, those flames. I guess the face, as I mean, it looks not realistic like nowadays we have, and of, co of course the legs, like I kind of mentioned before, and some of the inconsistencies. I, I guess like maybe this technic pieces, but I'm pretty sure like I never made them in brown, and probably will never never make them since I, I guess it's too expensive for the giant freaking company that makes so much Lego Star Wars. Jesus Christ. But I say this uh, honestly, you should definitely get or the set, or if you don't have enough money, then I try to get the used one. Holy crap, so much money for it. Well, sometimes again, I really need to drag on side, say it's uh, definitely worth getting, at least, at least in my book. Like, like, this is really, really fun to play. Like, I'm gonna show you. Like, look at that. This this is really, really fun to, fun to, fun to, really, to kind of even play with. Like, with, with. It's such a it's such a such a big of a drag dragon that I honestly I'm really, really happy happy to you to have it. And yeah, that is all all I wanted to say. There's really, there's really no, no no much. I kind of no, have no idea what kind of videos to make. You can uh, I'd say also you can you can see me you can actually check out what I'm doing on Twitch. I'm gonna definitely start playing playing some kind of some games. Uh, same to get some games today. All I have all you have to do is uh, go to the description. And there will be a link to my Twitch channel, Teppy666, and there you, you will be able to see uh, see that if I'm stream, streaming or not. Again, I'm gonna be streaming today. I can't really tell when, but I'm definitely gonna try to play to play some some games today. So goodbye, and I and stay and stay healthy.